Friends, I wanted to tell you about a disease that I had been recently diagnosed with, and it's called assume the worst itis. I was actually diagnosed with it years ago, but recently someone pointed out that I have moments where I assume the worst. Maybe you can relate. Maybe you have some of the same symptoms. You send a text message to someone and you expect them to text you back within seconds or minutes or an hour and they don't and you assume the worst. You send someone an email or you comment on their Facebook page or you send them a DM and they don't respond the way you want to or they don't at all and you assume the worst. You run into someone in the grocery store and they say, we should talk and you assume the worst. Here's the reality about assuming the worst. The only thing it adds to your life is worry, stress, anxiety, and panic. That's it. Because normally 98, 99% of the times, it's always best case scenarios. So we didn't even need to waste the mental energy, the emotional energy, assuming the worst. So the antidote for assume the worst-itis is assume the best. Say it with me, assume the best. Every situation you possibly can, just assume the best. And even if it is a yucky situation, there's conflict that you have to walk through with somebody. Like my friend Colette says, they can't take away your birthday. So you can get through the conflict and you can get to the other side and assume the best.